Oh no. Who let him on the plane? Mikey, switch with me. Mikey! What's up? Switch seats with me. Why? I like the aisle. Would you just listen? I don't want you sitting next to that guy. Fine. So we just have the aisle. Excuse me. Hey, Mohammed. I said, excuse me. Actually, my name is Baljeet. How can I help you? What are you chanting? It's a prayer I say before every flight. Is that an issue? Is that some sort of a Muslim thing? Uh, no. Actually, I'm a Sikh. But even if it were, would it matter? Hey. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. He should be staying away from those sunflower seeds. Since he's coughing. Thanks. But nobody asked you. Hello, everyone. Make sure your seatbelts are fastened. We'll be taking off in just a moment. Hello, hello. Hi, yes, can I help you? Yeah, um, I'm just, I'm a little concerned about, Why you know. Khalsa? Why oh, Ji was there something the matter? You don't hear him chanting? I mean, who knows what he's saying or plotting? Oh, there's a lot of passengers that pray before a flight, especially the Indian community. There's nothing to be concerned about, ma'am. Did you just take a picture of me? No. I just saw you. Why would you do that? I'm sending the picture to my husband, okay? May I know why? Yeah, because if anything happens on this flight, he'll know who's responsible. Responsible for what? Look, I don't have to explain myself to you. Hi, is everything okay over here? No, it is not. I do not feel comfortable sitting next to him. Can you please move us somewhere else? Unfortunately, there's only one seat in the back that's empty, but... You know what? I'll move. Are you sure? You really don't have to. I'll be fine. <sighs> Thank God he's gone. Please keep an eye on him. You never know what's in his bag. You know, you really shouldn't judge someone before you get to know them. I, I know a terrorist when I see one. I hope you're going to report this. I'm so glad that guy is gone. I just wish they had taken him off the plane completely. <coughs> Mikey? You all right? Mikey! Is everything all right? Help! Help! My son is choking! Oh my god, is he okay? No! Please, call a doctor! Okay, let me tell the captain. Breathe, honey. Come on! Would you like some water? No, he's already had water. He needs a doctor. Is there a doctor on board? I can help. No, don't stop! Don't touch him! What are you doing? He's got seas lodged in his throat. <gasps> we need to get them out. <gasps> Oh. oh my god. Thank you so much. I thought I was gonna die. You are very welcome. I would stay away from those sunflower seeds. I will. Wait. Thank you for saving my son. How did you know what to do? Well, you see. You said I must be a terrorist, but in reality, I'm a doctor. That is why I'm flying to LA to perform an emergency surgery on my patient. You're a doctor? I had no idea. 
Yes. And so you know I was praying for everyone's safety, including your son's, since I heard him cough. Really? You were praying for my son? I feel so terrible for how I treated you. I guess I really shouldn't judge a book by its cover. To be honest, I get stereotyped all the time. Unfortunately, that's the world we live in. Anyway, I'm glad you're feeling better. Thank you. Wait, don't go. Would you mind sitting here again? I would feel a lot more comfortable knowing you were there in case something were to happen. Uh, actually, sir, if you like, we'd love to upgrade you to first class. You know what? I'm fine here. Hey, Dara Man fam, please remember that we're not just telling stories, we're changing lives. And when you share my content, you're helping to change lives too. I appreciate you watching and I'll see you in the next video.